what's left is right Chasing stars and holding you I can't see the end, but we'll see it through the sign right here and there's these what look like the bigger lodges there okay and then a little ways up from that you have the all these lodge and, and restaurant and conference center I think this is where we check in look at that there we go there. reservations there like so we came in this way, park entrance, and then this is the towers overlook where we stopped. We came in through here, stopped by the lodge to check in. Well, actually, first we went this way and then saw the log cabins and the um, cottages this way. And then we realized you get to turn back around came to the lodge to check in, just past that visitor center, and now we are making our way around to get to the cottage this way. There's the um, Clinchfield no Overlook. Alright, so we are going and driving around here, and there's all these different overlooks Whoa. and trailheads. What? Deer right there. They're, they're not like scurrying away. They're just acting like they own this place. They do. So driving around like this on these roads, it's making me realize that this park, the whole park, is surrounded by these amazing views and all the trails around it um, is to these overlooks and pinnacles around around the uh, park, which is great. So from the campground and from the cottages, it looks like there is easy access to trails um, to get to these places. All right, we are cottage E. You can check it out. It's actually a lot bigger than when you drive. Oh my gosh, it's cold. Earth. <laughs> Oh, here's the downstairs. That. Okay, so this is the first floor. We have a table. There's the kitchen space right here. Oh, it's dark. All right, here we go. Okay, here's the bathroom. I mean, <laughs> here's the kitchen right there. And then the upstairs. This is the upstairs. Here we go. So here's the first first room. And then here is the second bedroom. And then here is the bathroom right here. turn off from the log cabins you can see there's cab uh, shelter four which is probably in front of cabin two or three um, that's shelter five over there and then you turn in here and then you have these row of cabins along the lake which are much closer to each other than I expected so that's five here four and five where our friends are staying and then one two three over there in the back side that's the cabin it looks like it's right four that's four and then all along here really close <laughs> and then right across the way is the shelter shelter five which is a great place for hanging out right there
Luna. All right, so here is the cabins. We got the loft up there, and then living space down here. Kitchen, yeah. Fireplace, yeah. Yeah. All right, so this here looks like king size bed. Who's in here? Maybe with a bathroom there. A deck out there. This leads out to a river, lake, not river, lake view right here. Here's a screened in porch. So beautiful out here. Did y'all want to eat dinner, Martha? Right, back no, in here. This is the queen sized bedroom. Really a lot of space. And everything smells new. And then this is the, I guess, the second bathroom that leads to the queen sized bedroom. And then right here is the loft. And this loft is so much bigger <laughs> than I was imagining. It's quite large. Even has a dresser situation right here. Geological trail, the white blaze shows the way. We kind of had trouble initially finding where the entry was, but it was to the right of the overlook, state line overlook, and now we are clambering through here. This is where the geological trail meets up with a little bit of this um, laurel branch. And so we'll be on that for just a little while. So at this point, there is a path up there, but we are going to follow the path down here. There's no marker for it, but we're assuming this follows this orange trail right there to meet the yellow. There's the orange and then we see the yellow for the brakes trail marker there, so we'll follow that. We're now on the brakes trail and less rocky here, um, but you can tell that it's very windy 
Uh, it's probably mimicking this area over here before we get down to the bottom. All right, so we got here, which is at the bottom, the Central Creek Trail right here. It goes that way. We can definitely hear and smell the water. And then going this way would take us along the creek to meet the Russell Fork River. Thank you.